So on Friday, just before the weekend, I decided to install the public test server for the Division 2 and check out the changes to the skills in the Dark Zone. Here's how that went. Stand still, okay? Stand still, stand still. I'm just trying to like... I'm not a gamer anymore, okay? Like, I'm just trying to like... TACTICAL NUKE INCOMING! <laughs> what the fuck? Come on, bro. <laughs> I didn't want to start the stream like this. There's a reason why I destroyed that thing. <laughs> Rogue agent neutralized. Okay, let me let me just try to run out from the checkpoint, okay? I, I'm a zoomy zoomy boy. Once you get past, no, those. don't shoot, don't shoot. I'm just running. I'm just running. I mean, it is possible. It is possible. I'm just oh, on the floor and blind no. and everything. It's it's like the normal healer hive, dude. It, as soon as those things fly you. out, you're dead. It follows you. <laughs> hey, at least when you die, you're not blind anymore. So that's a plus. A little bit later, that same day. I, uh, I did whatever a sane human would do in uh, in my position. I uninstalled the public test server and bought the Forsaken expansion for Destiny 2. In the Netherlands, we have this saying that uh, it goes something like, the weed's always greener on the other side. Something like that, something with green. So uh, I wanted to see if that was true. Uh, I wanted to see it for myself this time. So I wanted to play some Destiny 2 in this case. Now, it's not like I never played the game before. I played at launch when it came out for PC, right up until light level 190. Oh, look at that majestic character. <laughs> That's just beautiful. I didn't know, even though you can make him that fucked up. Holy shit. What do you mean fucked up? You know, this is, this is just beautiful. But I'm going to play with another guy. Oh, yeah, boys. I think I got my character. It's perfect. Look, look at him breaking his neck to look at my ass. I see what he's doing. I see that. I feel so free. I can jump anywhere. This is like so different from the vision. You can like go do random shit. Yeah. Almost break your legs, but it's like so freeing, you know? I'm not stuck to a box like this. Oh, oh, nope, nope, nope. Okay. Initial impressions were pretty positive. Uh, being able to jump around feels very good after being stuck to cover all those years. So yeah. I just started playing, I guess. I didn't really follow the story too much since we used the boosters to skip to level 30 right away. And I had also already seen a whole bunch of cutscenes on YouTube. So uh, I ended up spoiling half the game by accident. Wait, isn't this where he dies? I think I've seen this. He dies? I'm spoiling. What the fuck? We'll bring him back, you know. He's not permanently dead. Oh, he looks like sleepy oh, he's now. Gone. I'll be back. It's like the 100, you know. They just put his conscience in another body. Holy shit, you just don't give a fuck. Somebody didn't watch Game of Thrones and wants some spoilers? Yeah, but you already watched it, right? <laughs> yeah, I did. But you're streaming the fish. Oh, no. Fucking hell. On top of that, we also had our light level 750 friend that goes by the name Fryco narrate our 14 hour walkthrough uh, and explaining the mechanics to us as we go. You're not forced to use two kinetic weapons or two primary weapons. You can use, oh. like, a, uh, let's say, a hand cannon, a shotgun, and, like, a rocket launcher, like Mark is right now. Yeah, Sleepy, take notes. <laughs> take notes, yeah. Please. Take notes, buddy. Yeah, um, my character did distract from taking the story seriously. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Oh no, looking stunning. Looking good. Oh my god, what is that? So story-wise, I didn't get the most out of it. But with all this set up and good to go, our Destiny 2 adventure started right here a few days ago. And it was a rough start. Oh, we're almost here. Uh, we just go... Yeah, we just go straight, actually. There's a chest right here, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. What one? Hey, what, where the fuck are you? <laughs> I'm coming back. How do you mark something on the map? You can't. Are we playing Anthem? Only missions. Playing Anthem here? Okay, okay. And we can just go over the rope here. That's not where we're supposed to go 100%. There's no way. Oh, okay, okay. Oh. Okay, that's not where we're supposed to go. You were right. Who am I playing with? Just two papayas. I'm sorry, Ill the Superior Gamer. <laughs> uh, thing that I it's like it's like right here. Come on, guys. Channel your inner door to Explorer and help me find this chest. I think it's under the bridge. Yeah, uh, under here. Yeah, don't follow me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right, all right, all right, I think it's under the bridge. Okay. Like right here. Yeah, I found it. It's a cave here. This has to be it, right? Yeah, I got it. I got it here. But even though we were kind of just fucking around. I was still having fun with it. Uh, the one thing that I noticed very quickly though is how much auto-aim this game has. Even when you're playing with mouse and keyboard. 
Oh my god, this game has so much idle aim, I swear, dude. I just missed that guy by a mile and it still counted. Now, don't get me wrong, I consider this being a good thing, because this way we could play the game and still focus on the more important topics at hand. I mean, I always finish first, what are you talking about? Uh, I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. It is, it's a good thing, it's very time efficient. What does your okay. girlfriend say to that? I don't have a girlfriend. No, no, but I actually go to the bar and I'll tell them I'm gear score um, 500 in Division 2. Mark with a womanizer. Yeah, woman go crazy. I even say I have the eagle bearer, you know? It's guaranteed to... Even though you don't. I know, but I mean, they don't know. Everybody gotta hustle, you know? What made you want to try Destiny 2? Well, I played the Division 2 uh, BTS, and that's what made me decide to try Destiny 2. Yeah, I watched that. That, that did not look... It, it was pretty rough. I also found out that you can drive vehicles in Destiny 2 as opposed to the Division. What the hell? What's happening? This thing is broken. You need to keep driving it. You're basically leveling it up by driving it. Wait, who's this? That's, uh, Kick random. Sleepy off. Kick that sleepy guy's off. doing the same quest as you guys. What does this guy think he's doing? No. Yeah, no. get fucked, Sleepy. No. He kicked him off. <laughs> what a laugh, dude. <laughs> get this guy, get this guy. Kick him off as well. <laughs> oh, he already fell off. <laughs> he fell off. All right, I'll revive you, but like, how, how do I revive him? Hold on. Just don't. No, don't revive Just him. Just don't. don't. <laughs> oh no, no, what? Sleepy, you baited me. Sleepy, what? Nice one. Marco, what do you mean? Nobody you just drove down the cliff. You baited You just want to kill yourself. You just, you're just a depressed gamer, okay? That, that was, that was 100%. Depressed gamer, I know. You, you baited me to go there. That's your fault. No, 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 no. All right, let's be honest here, guys. That last one really was Sleepy's fault, you know? But uh, luckily, Karma really is a bitch, and he got what he deserved swiftly after. Oh my god. Oh, Sleepy, watch out. The thing that's <laughs> Sleepy, so watch out! Hey, I'm the time! <laughs> no, I didn't get it again! That's the kind of stuff we need more in this game. I don't see though how this is gonna help us here. Yeah? I mean, this is the way to the mission. It's an adventure. It's not a mission, it's an adventure. Same thing. It's like it's saying it's a stronghold, it's still a mission. Lines. We're on the Baron that murdered Kate's Oh, what ghost. the fuck? The ship just disappeared. You saw that? I think the rifleman. I don't think we're supposed to stay here, right? We gotta drop down here. How do you get up there? Sleepy, you baited me again. You know what's funny? I jumped down there as well. It's all Sleepy's fault. Oh, he's right here. Actually, that's yeah. super fast. That's easy. Okay. <laughs> go, go again, brother. And yeah, that's basically how the experience continued. We spent a lot more time than we needed to on this planet, I think. This is almost the only planet that we did any activities on. The best part was probably the part where we got to use a tank. Oh, what the? Jesus, <laughs> you fucking monkey, you fucking mate. Dude, I don't know what's funnier, the fact that you killed him or the laugh. <laughs> he got such a retarded laugh, I'm not gonna lie. Perfect. Oh shit. Oh, what Wait. the fuck is this? What? Marco, Marco. Marco. What are you doing? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <laughs> what the? Too much steps at it again. No, they made this game as well. <laughs> All right, they're in the back and in the front. What are we gonna do about it? <laughs> yeah, how can you fight this, huh? <laughs> All right, you took him out. Good job. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What's happening? What? <laughs> no. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> broom, 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 broom. It's a helicopter. <laughs> it's a helicopter. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, dude. It's okay. Fuck your body. <laughs> what the? Wow. Okay. <laughs> Can't even get on the bike. I see how it is. <laughs> Let's get this one, you what know. Bike? <laughs> Ah, you can do the boss yourself. Go fuck yourself, dude. I am doing the boss myself. Look at the HP. Yep. Oh yeah, I'm having a great time, guys. The final boss was also pretty cool. I still couldn't take the cutscenes too seriously, though. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. Oh, that's a little creepy. 
<laughs> That's a little creepy, like, hello. I'd probably still fuck, to be honest. <laughs> that would be a skip for me. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a hot and crazy factor. I think she falls still in, still in the fuckable range. She's not crazy enough, you know? <laughs> Yeah, that's no, what Margo likes. What? She, she's pretty crazy, but she's also pretty hot, you know? But uh, what the hell, man? Come on, why did you skip it? Dude, Margo was getting like a hot on on this. Can't have that happening. <laughs> yeah. I'll watch it back on YouTube, you know? Oh, what the hell is that? Okay, that's a little too crazy for me, you know? <laughs> With all the tentacles and... Yeah, no, I'm gonna skip that. Basically, this creepy looking dude got eaten by that big Oh, ball. no. The face. This is what happens when you fuck with the feminists. <laughs> <laughs> they gotta shoot you up. Uh, after that, we played some more PvP to uh, level up to level 50. We played some more quests to get light level 690, I believe it was. And then we did uh, Menagerie a few times until we were closer to light level 700. Um, so yeah, I, I guess it's time for some quick thoughts, you know, don't want to go into it too much, but the game's fun. It's alright. It can be a real mess to figure out what you have to do at times, uh, because as a new player you have about 50 different objectives and you only need to do one of those uh, objectives. One specific one to get you from light level 500 to light level 690, at least that's the way I understood it. Uh, I'm pretty sure that if we didn't have our narrator play with us, uh, helping us through these 14 hours, we would have been spending days figuring out what to do. Uh, the PvP can also be a bit messy. I mean, I obviously still stuck at the game, but you know, let's not talk about that. Let's just talk about the general PvP, not look at my gameplay too much. I felt that uh, the PvP was kind of cheesy. It's sometimes pretty hard to take straight up 1v1 fights, everybody is just flying around the rooms with shotguns and ults, and it's uh, it, it's a little hard to, to, to play the PvP like an arena shooter. I guess that's not what this game is supposed to be. Which leaves me to guess that the real meat of the game are the raids, which we haven't done yet, and we're probably gonna do in the future. But playing Destiny 2 definitely made me realize two things. One thing is, is that the grass is not always greener on the other side. The Division 2, for example, has a lot of quality of life things that Destiny 2 is missing. Uh, Destiny's menus are a mess. There are no custom waypoints on the map. You can only highlight uh, missions. There are so many loading screens which can take forever if just one guy in the session doesn't have an SSD. And there are quite some bugs as well. Uh, for example here where you get stuck in orbit or stuck in the loading screen for up to 10 minutes straight, which, uh, you know, it makes you alt F4 the game to have a faster loading speed. And at times I really felt like I was spending just as much time in the tower, in the menus, talking to people, trying to get some missions, uh, as that I was actually playing the game. I think the general combat and the gameplay feels better than a Division. Uh, the freedom in movement and all the abilities are cool especially. That shit is just missing from the Division too. You can't compare an ult to a Firefly. It's just, it's just not how it works. Uh, but yeah, Destiny 2 ain't all perfect either. Conclusion time is, is that I probably will not be ending up making tons of Destiny videos. Not that that's needed, because Destiny has already so many really good content creators for it. But hey, uh, I, I guess that's the question that some of you might have had. I'll definitely check back uh, the new update in September, see what's up, see what's going on. But for now, the search for a new game to main continues. Alright, that was it for this video. Uh, it was a little bit of a different video, a different style. You know, still testing out stuff for the channel. Hope you enjoyed it. And as always, see you later.